<laughs> All right, guys, here we're talk about the trailer for the movie The Clove Hitch Killer. That title doesn't grab me. I, it seems like a little... Uh, it's a little weird, right? Even if I was... Even if, if, if there's a good reason, if it's based on like a book or something like that, I'd be or like, a real thing. I'd be like, we have to change this. It, it's 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 like too close to Cloverfield. This I is, think this I think if you would have called this the killer of Clovehitch, I think that would have something with a little more of a ring. I don't know something about that. It me a little more. I um, see Thriller. I see Dylan McDermott. This interests me for those for, for in those theaters reasons. and iTunes the same day. So uh, which you always look to as a mark a of sign of quality. quality. Sign of Excellent. quality. Um, I don't know anything about the story. Let's just check it yeah. out. Okay, so obviously we're both a few merit badges short of a whatever sash, because a clove hitch is, is is like a thing apparently. Yes. Okay, good. <laughs> I did not. That. I was not aware of this. No. Uh, so Dylan McDermott looks so different with just the glasses. Yeah. Like, is that enough that it, like he's he seems like a totally different person? <laughs> well, and this starts off, and I'm and and he's like, "Hey, family, or whatever," and I was like, "Oh no, is he not the killer?" Because I really liked him in American Horror Story as like the killer guy, uh -huh. and then it turns out he's the killer guy. Yes. That's great. No, no, that, and and like he's definitely uh, he's definitely acting because I like I, I like acting. I'm a fan of acting. It seems like lately there's been a lot of phoning it in for for like uh, Dylan McDermott. No, but like um, no, 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 in no. big you, movie actors where I'm like, I'm like, guy, <coughs> oh, you're really not. not he, he, this mm. seems like he's selling it. He does. He feels like a dad. Um, did it say what the time period was for this? I don't it know. Feels it feels like older. this is the '90s. Yeah. Uh, maybe late '80s. Uh, just something something about the the dress and and just mm -hmm. the vibe you're getting here. Um, no, it had, had a. It was a a very. Um, what would be the word here? The the trailer hit all the marks where you're like, okay, I know exactly what this movie is, and uh, and I'm super interested. I want to see like like this I, goes, how, how this pans out. I think out. we almost know too much because he's obviously the killer, right? No, no, yes, he couldn't possibly he's, not. He's be the obviously the killer, but yeah. but you're gonna like, is he gonna end up killing the girl? But it's does about the, does like does he know the, the kill, son him knows? Being the killer. Yeah. Yes. And it looked like he has some plans for some torture basement or yes. or, uh, or something. Uh, I, I want to know if that's if those those are plans he's enacted. Is he working on getting those? How many people has he killed? No, uh, I, love, I love like what is this girlfriend of his like? She's like some sort of a crime expert. She has like the box of like all the uh, no, I, the I, information. I love the whole thing. There was a movie that someone else I think whose name is also Dylan did where he's I, it's called Stepdad or Stepfather or something like that. Okay, I never saw it, but the trailer made it look awesome. Where like, um, you know, it's like I'm a family guy. This guy's like, oh, he's doing church stuff. He's uh -huh. doing whatever. <laughs> Ooh, awkward talk with dad. Ooh, doing all these stupid things, and then he's like got this dark side, this like good son crazy mm. uh, side thing going. I love that. I don't much care for the lead, the the son, the some, boy, something about him. No, he's gross. It doesn't it doesn't do it for me. But everybody else seems really on point, so I think it'll it'll carry. It'll be fine. Well, he might this, even grow know, on me. This looks like to your earlier point, like like uh, Dylan McDermott, like a script came across his thing, and he was like, "I'd like to do this smaller movie and like stretch my shit a little bit and uh, yeah. have some fun here and do some acting or whatever." No, and yeah. uh, I I always <clears throat> like the Dexter style, like keep your stuff in the shed thing. Yeah. I love that it's just like a little tiny like high school like lock, stupid lock. Like, oh, yeah. One to the right, two to the left. Yeah, something that could bring down your whole life is being held by something with a bolt cutter that could just get right to. Yeah, isn't that ridiculous? And that so many things are probably like that across the world. Where no, like yeah, things that are uh, pivotal to to keeping you alive. Uh, your, your your whole life as you know it falling apart. Yeah. A ninety-nine cent lock is keeping well, it safe, and he's compartmentalized, and he's he's in a sense hiding in plain sight. So like, yeah, ha having a less elaborate lock is almost a way of like, oh, nothing special in here. But why and, not? Uh, why even keep it in the shed? I wonder if the mom knows though. She, your father has his own hobbies. All that stuff. I doubt it, but that would that be would an be interesting twist. Is like they run to, to like her the for very help. End. We gotta go, and she's like, no, you don't. You gotta stay. <laughs> Daddy's You're there. not our first kid. Oh, God. <laughs> <laughs> with, with, you know, I've had 38 children. <laughs> we keep uh, moving across the country. We're vampires. Um, no, this is, you know, this is like a little on the nose, but I think they're, they're like elevating it a little where, where he is like the man of God and the Eagle Scout troop leader and all that nonsense. Yeah, no, I, I like this. But it's, it like works, I think. It would also be like hysterical if somehow he wasn't the killer. That's what I'm I've saying. I've been tracking him for years. <laughs> I have all these things. I found his boy. Like I've been trying to catch him. Exactly. Like that. He has to be the killer, though. He he. That's what I mean. Is I prefer if the trailer stops just short. A of little it. vague. Just yeah. a little short of like obviously because there's some scenes here they're like weaving in quick cuts of stuff that's clearly later. Like his mom <laughs> is the killer. Yeah. <laughs> no, that's what I mean. Like uh, it's it's entirely possible. And then when he's leading him off into the woods, it's because he has to cover up for her or something like that that would be super no no he has no idea oh he's 
<laughs> they're kid, just going on a hunting trip. This kid's mouthing off. Yeah, yeah, yeah. right? That would be like... That's, that would be amazing. It's I, not that. It would be amazing. Though. I know it's not that, but that's what I love. Like, when a movie can do that and, like, lead you... Like, like you go into it like, well, it's about this guy that kills his wife. Yeah. And then by the end, you're like, oh, my God! And it's this whole thing that happens. Yeah. Uh, I agree with you that it's not that, though. But no, I still think this will be good I, I do think, I do think as yeah. fully described with this blueprint laid out in front of us in the form mm-hmm. of this trailer, it'll still be a pretty good movie. Yeah, I think we're thumbsing this up. Right? Oh, yeah, I give this a thumbs up. Good times. All right, guys, let us know in this console what you thought about it. Don't die in a fire, and we'll see you next time. Hello, Internet. I just love watching Just Taggers. If you've enjoyed this video as much as I have, click that subscribe button. <laughs> uh, peace out, homies.